Life Defenders are in studio with us right now with the cutest little animal. Well, his name is Nico, not Nico. He's cute. <laughs> but we're talking about little Phyllis Quiller. Lori, you've got him in your hands right now. And Lance, of course, is here as well. Oh. We've got Nico Rivera. He's one of the Wildlife Defender campers here to talk all about a great camp this summer. But first, let's get right to this little creature. Who is she? Well, this is one of our newest animal ambassadors. Um, actually, uh, she comes from Buffalo, New York. She's got a very, very interesting background. And uh, yeah, she's a North American porcupine. And of course, uh, Nico being one of our longtime campers and fans, he, uh, he can tell you some very interesting porcupine facts. What do yeah? you got for us, Nico? Um, well, the porcupines um, are usually, they have 30,000 quills Whoa. on them. Whoa. That's a lot. And yeah. each quill has a little barb at the end. Oh, so you want to be really, you want to be nice to, to little <laughs> Phyllis over here, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so she's eating um, some lettuce this morning. What do they like to eat? What kinds of stuff do they like um, to eat? Well, Phyllis likes to eat um, bananas and lettuce. Mm, good. <laughs> good call. Okay, that's awesome. That's a good diet. Yeah. It she's is. a healthy little girl. And as a baby, I, 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 I want a pet because it just made the cutest little yeah. sound. As a baby, the quills, are they prickly then and tough then or are they soft now? No, they'll <laughs> stab like, you. Uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs> they'll stab you. Yeah. Thank you for the warning, Nico. Okay, yeah. I appreciate it. He nailed it. They are born precocially, which means fully formed. So when they're born, they do have teeth, they have claws, and yes, they have those quills. Okay. And so that's their defense mechanism because they're not very aggressive animals, right? They're not... No, no, not at all. You know, they like to be left alone. You know, they're highly arboreal animals, and uh, the quills are just a defense. They do not shoot quills. You know, we mm -hmm. think that's important to remember for uh, people out there. And sure. uh, actually, you're going to be able to uh, meet Phyllis at our upcoming animal exploration camp. Wow, you know, what is that? You know, that is coming up from the 10th to the 14th, and we still have some slots open. You can register with the Canandaigua Parks and Recreation Department. And we want to thank the community that makes that camp possible. This is our fifth, an our fifth annual uh, camp. And um, yeah, it's all thanks to the efforts of Pontillas Pizza in Canandaigua. We want to thank, That's you know, awesome. Furniture Villar Village, uh, Chessler Photography, and Wegmans for uh, making it possible. Ah, Chessler Photography. They're and my wedding photographer. Did they really? Any, in case you want to be a wedding <laughs> photographer. <laughs> and Nico, you, you have been a part of this camp before. You, you, you really have had a good time, haven't you? Yeah, it's really fun. Yeah, what do you get go? to do? Well, you get to um, see the animals, <laughs> interact with the animals, and you learn a lot of facts about them. Look at Phyllis go. So she's she's very agile. Look at her. She's able to climb up that the little pole there. Well, We're, she's got spunk. I mean, we have a picture, I think, of her namesake, don't we? Oh, of the, <laughs> Phyllis Diller. Yes. Yeah, I, I yeah very, very, very similar go. hair, no yeah, doubt. Very similar. <laughs> I love that. It's similar hair. There, oh, there it is. is. There it is. <laughs> You know, so people uh, still have time to sign up if they want their kid involved in the camp, right? Absolutely. Um, yeah, we do have some slots still open, and as I said, they can uh, sign up with the Canandaigua Parks and Recreation Department. Okay, that's okay. awesome. What is the what is the hours for the for the day of it, camp? It, it's a day camp, so it'll be running uh, roughly uh, ten to four. Okay, all that's right. That's awesome. But you've been how long have you been a camper there now? I this is going on my fourth year. I think. Fourth Whoa. year. Okay. Yeah, so you're not afraid of these there. animals, are you? Mm -mm. No, nothing. Nothing's scary. Even the creepy crawlies? <laughs> no. I have held the cockroaches and stuff. No, you yeah. didn't. Yeah. Okay, that's good. Uh, okay, okay. And that's, of course, what you really want is these kids to learn to love animals, even if they're not so pretty, right? Exactly. Even if they're not so cute, you know, like, like They're the Phyllis future here. stewards of the environment, so uh, getting respect for all the uh, living creatures out there is so important with yeah. our work. You've had such a busy summer, your group. Every time I go on Facebook, you're working on something else, so we wish you the best of luck. Have a great rest of the summer. Nico, awesome to meet you. Yeah. yeah nice meeting you, too. Cool. Look at just Phyllis. She's like, I'm just... She's just eating. <laughs> it's breakfast time. It's breakfast. And who's going to stop her? Not me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm leaving her alone. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be back. Z-Bar